Hello everyone, my name is John Cordham and I'm here at the Monroe Institute. I'm just about to begin my course on biological intuition. Now you may be asking yourself, what is a biological intuitive? I would say for uh, most of my career, I've been called a medical intuitive. We're back with medical intuitive John Cordham, who's about to reveal an amazing technique. Thank you, Dr. Manning. Medic I never met a medical intuitive before. Well, it's a pleasure. What people often hear that it implies or even expresses is that I would be offering medical advice or alternative or substitute medical advice, which is not exactly what I do. Now, I, I was tested in a clinical environment and evaluated. So in, in those situations, yes, you know, doctors wanted to see how accurate I could be. But what I found over time was that like a biologist uh, has an understanding of living organisms and what provides an optimal environment for life and living organisms and it has an understanding about how the systems of that organism operate to sustain life. Biologist isn't really diagnosing illness or looking to diagnose an illness like a medical doctor is. And I'm not looking to diagnose an illness when I necessarily work with you. I'm not a doctor and that's why I don't diagnose. I am looking to provide you with information that will support an optimal living environment for the rest of your life. So welcome to Biological Intuition. Hi, everyone. I'm here uh, in, at the Monroe Institute in Virginia. Hello, my name is Sabrina Smith, and I am in, from Everett, Washington. I'm Adrienne Charles. I'm a native New Yorker. I live in the Washington, D.C. area. My name is Shazia. I am from New Jersey. My name is Rashi Sharma, and I'm from India, Bangalore. I am in the healthcare field, traditional healthcare field, for over 40 years. I work as a a uh, massage therapist. I'm a physician. I'm a hypnotherapist, past life regression therapist, LBL therapist, and uh, a shamanic healer. And I'm real eager to see uh, what the weekend presents. I am taking the cordon technique because I'm interested in how that would help me help my patients. I don't have any medical background. I'm very excited to uh, learn what John has to offer. Less than 48 hours have transpired, and John has taught us how to identify conditions that are perhaps emerging or present. Wow, a lot of information. Um, I'm just so excited about um, the many different indicators that I was actually able to see. The indicators that I found um, most easy to recognize and relate to were the musculoskeletal, the cardiovascular. The indicators are right in front of us. And now when I think of my family members, I'm all the pieces of the puzzles are fitting together for me. And I never thought, because I never had a medical background, I would be able to see so many indicators. I could do very well with ear and neurological, blood, gastro, GI. We've learned how to identify uh, heart, uh, gastrointestinal issues, um, liver issues, blood issues, um, and it just has been remarkably informative. I think the easiest ones that I could detect were like ear sinus, um, gastrointestinal, and uh, like spine neck indicators. Whether you have medical uh, knowledge, a medical background, or anyone else who wants to help themselves or their family. So what came easiest to me was to see the liver indicator, the cardiovascular, and I think even the uh, reproductive, urinary reproductive indicator as well. We can understand and get to know the indicators early. We can see it early in anybody's life so that they don't go suffer later on in their life. So this was an amazing course. Um, highly recommend it to everyone. I do not have a medical background, so uh, you know, for me to be able to see all the indicators, um, it's I'm just blown by this course. Thank you so much.